Welcome back to Loving Living Local. Christmas on Caddo Fireworks Festival is taking place this weekend and here to give us all those exciting details on what we can expect this year is Casey Body Hartley. Thanks for joining us. Thank you so much for having me. Well, let's talk about Christmas on Caddo, what we can expect and where it's going to be. Okay, um, uh, the first Saturday of December is always uh, the Christmas on Caddo Fireworks Festival in Oil City at Earl G. Williamson Park. Um, festivities kick off at four. It's a free event. Uh, it's for families, all little kids. There'll be something for everybody. Santa Claus will be there. Wonderful. Um, because of what's going on in the world today, it is a drive-in edition. Um, so I think the park, uh, we can hold up to about 700 cars and they're gonna strategically place all the cars so that they can be lined up in a, where, in a place where they can see the fireworks that are gonna ha happen at 6.30. But you know, that would be kind of nice. You can contain the kids in the car. You mm -hmm. can stay nice and cozy. You can enjoy That's some right. hot chocolate while you watch That's the, right. the great display. Well, I know there's a lot going on with Christmas on Caddo, so let's talk about the scholarship program, which okay. is open to anyone. Um, open to any enrolled Caddo Parish student, boy or girl, yes. The deadline for the application um, and the essay is Friday at five o'clock. Um, you can download an application from the website, christmasoncaddofireworks.com, and then those can be emailed to the Christmas on Caddo email. Simple enough. So if you wanted to get a sneak peek at the action that's going to be going on with Christmas on Caddo and find out all the times and where you should be and maybe even a map of the location, mm -hmm. you have it all conveniently located on the website. Correct. Yes. Everything's there. So Christmas on Caddo, it's coming up on December 5th in Oil City. It's going to be beautiful, spectacular, mm -hmm. and you said it is as safe and friendly as possible as you can make it. Yes, and, and Santa Claus will be there, and uh, we encourage all the kids to come and, of course, adhere by the guidelines that are set forth by us. Um, he will be able to speak with children and listen to their Christmas wishes, but socially distanced. And each kid will be able to get a toy of some sort to kind of tide them over until Christmas, of course. <laughs> that is wonderful. Yes. Well, let's revisit because the scholarship, you know, as we are approaching the end of the year, I know a lot of high school students are really counting those dollars and pension yes. pennies. So what does the scholarship involve? Um, it's an application tells us a little bit about your, um, your educational career so far. And then, of course, it has uh, an essay. And the essay is basically why you feel Christmas on Caddo is an important um, event to have each year. Why is it important to you? Why is it important to um, the town that it's in and the surrounding areas that people go, that the people from those areas go to? Wonderful. Well, Casey, thank you so much for joining us today. Christmas on Caddo is coming up December 5th. You do not want to miss this beautiful fireworks spectacular display. Okay. And I think we are ordering good weather for it for this weekend. And as we get closer, we'll take a look at that. But right now, today's weather, Josh has got it. Well, I'll tell you what, the uh, weekend weather is looking pretty.